Good morning, friends. So this is where a little truck like this. I love that song, Simple Mind. You see, this is a really nice little truck. Okay, we're off on an adventure, me and my boy. Who's this? Cool. It's rocky where we're going. And it's in the depths of Vancouver Island in the forest. It's a journey. Come with me along on this journey. <laughs> Friends, we live in paradise. The world is a beautiful place. Go out and see things. Your mind will expand. Um, Vancouver Island is known for its timber and it's old growth forests. Uh, there are other places where, like I'm big on the logging history and timber, Oregon, Washington, uh, certain areas, Australia, big wood. Uh, Vancouver Island is on the map. So uh, for that gig, world renowned timber. Um, we're gonna go see some of that today. It's gonna be cool. I'll show you when we get there. Follow along, it's gonna be a blast today. All right, friends, we're on the Pacific Marine, little shortcut to Renfrew. We're on logging truck number six or seven, son? Seven. Seven. Logging truck number seven. So we're uh, we're heading to meet a, a, a friend, and we're going for a cruise. Weather's eh, a little moisture than I'd like to see, but it is what it is. it's a rainforest. We're not worried about it. It'll come and go. Like the weather does. Oh, so, yeah. so friends, uh, we're in a zone here now that got frazzled by by forest fire. This wasn't here last time I came through. I was falling here. Um, oh heavens! Three? No, no, not oh. that long ago. I did a stint. Oh, wow. I did a hemlock dump. Uh, look at this! Wow. Weird how it just missed a couple. Like, look. There's the odd little green tree in there. Yeah. So this is forest fire show here. Steep, steep ground. So sad when the fire hits, you know. But uh, this is old growth in here. Look at this rocky terrain. We're just flying down the logging road here now. But, it, you know, just acres and acres and hectares and hectares of, of forest fire. I know I'm going fast, friends, but we're just... Look at that Look knob at right there that got saved out. Those big, you know why those big old growth made it? The bark. Up on the knob there. They made it because of the bark. Culvert replacement completed. Look at these hemlock. So, we're just about getting closer to meeting our tour guide friends um, in Port Renfrew. We're getting there. Oh, here's the uh, new culvert. Looks good. Oh, the creek fell over. So, just a, wanted to show that little chunk there. I hope, it, I hope the GoPro did it, you know. Hey, Sonny? Justice. Get that camera out of my face. Get that camera out of my face, he says. So here we are again, friends. We're kind of starting to open up. We're going through old clear cut. Um, little patches here and there, and, 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 and forest. Again, like I say, this is... Uh, this whole hill go. Yeah, this is, like this that. has been this has been dark. And long. We're on the other side of it. Yeah, exactly. So. Up and around the corner. Yeah, so we've come up and over and we're on the other side of it. That's right. Oh jeez. Yeah, look here, friends. So this this was a big bad fire. It just roasted, you know. And uh whole mountain. This thing yeah, you mountain. look at what it could have got, you know. But part of nature running its source. Nature, yeah, I mean look at it up there, Sonny. Stump farm. Friends, we got a bear. We got a bear right here. Look at him. He 
He's coming right out in front of the truck. There he goes. <laughs> I knew we'd see one today. Off he goes. Hi, buddy. Oh, there he goes. oh right there. Oh, you can't see him on the GoPro. That is so cool. Those are big animals. He's a big beast, isn't he? There he is there. Here he goes, traipsing through the woods. Bop, bop. <laughs> Come here, Chester. Come here, Chester. Come on, Scooter. He's just roaming through there, like, just loping around. Yeah. I knew we'd see one today. I hope you guys saw it. They probably saw it on the road. But yeah. I don't think they could have seen him through the bush there. So I think, there. did we, are we on the right road? I would imagine so. Okay, friends, we, we're, we're here. We, we made it. Me and, me and Ganges, we ripped through that hole where I showed you. We didn't do a ton of footage through there. It's a narrow road, but we're in Renfrew. We're right in Port Renfrew. Here's the fire department. It's a little community, and we've just met up with our tour guide, and I'll, I'll introduce you to him. Nice fella. I, I mean, first time I've met him. This is him here. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, friends. and it's Re Reg, is it? Reg, yeah. Reg. Reg from England. You're from England? England, yeah. That's a long way to come for us, yeah. Reg. To, or you've come this to tour us today. Just today, yeah, yeah. mate. I'm getting the flight back later. Yeah, so it was an eight, ten hour flight? Probably more. Really? Probably more. Fourteen. It's a long way. This is the, the dedication this man has Absolutely. for the West Coast, Vancouver Island, and his job of now. He was a tree man, but he's now decided to go yeah. into the tour, tour, tour guiding. Yeah. Was it the knees, Reg, that took you out finally? It was a lot of things. Yeah. Uh, conscience, mainly. Your conscience? Conscience. For green, being green. <laughs> you know, I go through that, Reg. I know. I go through the I conscience. Through, I went through it every day. The cutting. So I've gone from the, the poacher to the gamekeeper. I love it. Excellent. It. So, so, <laughs> so. For, for today. For today. Yeah. You know, my. I was just saying to my son, Hogan, that. My wife would, because I let a lot of fallen. Like, it was steady yeah. and lots up here. Mm. And my wife would say to me sometimes, honey, don't you? Because I'm a hippie at heart. I mean, I am. I love, you know, everybody knows that. But she would say, honey, don't you get, don't you feel bad? You know, cutting trees, don't, doesn't it kind of get to you sometimes? And I'd say, maybe sometimes, certain patches. Yeah. Certain I patches think, of think, wood. You know, I think when you're into it, you wear a different cap. You do. And, and when you're away from it and you reflect and you know that's when you might uh, have a few doubts or feel it yeah you, you know it's but you know you move on to something else and yeah and your focus goes elsewhere and you put that out of your mind that's just that's the reality of it, it, yes it is it 100 percent i mean it, it, another thing i was uh, what mm. i would say is do you like the car you're driving honey you know mm. What are we? What are we gonna do? You know, it's what we know how to do. Um, but I, I'm one of them guys that believes now in our industry that old growth should be untouched, completely untouched, left alone. I think what's left. Don't you agree? I, I think that there's so little of it's it left of it, now. Yeah. yeah. And it's not just the trees; it's the whole ecosystem. Yes, it is. Do you yeah. know what I mean? Oh, 100 like, percent. We've had our fill. Now it's time to rethink. Yeah, I agree. Um, well, very excited to meet our tour guide. We're hungry. We're going to eat before we get out on the journey. Reg just got a little place for us to go. See you down there. Thanks, Reg. Done them too. Then we'll go uh, like to the Red Creek. Uh, oh, 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 we get the Red Creek too. Yeah. So, uh, so, but on the way there, you, you go past the, the, the what used to be the second biggest spruce as well in the world. In the world, the but then the, the top blew out. Yes. So that's that's a nice one. There's a nice little campsite there too. Okay, that that sounds very good. Hogan, are you excited? I'm quite excited. Oh, good. Me too. I've been my buddies to come down here, but now I don't have. Yeah, but now you know what? Have, they don't have to. I don't have to drag them out. I tell people this all the time. They don't care about. You. Well, we can all talk, right, friends? We can talk about doing stuff. Easy to talk it's about nice doing feeling. stuff. It's hey. Nice oh, it is. It is nice. <laughs> Sorry, the, the the guide. Reg is our guide today. He's kind of pointing his finger in front of my camera because it was a nice view and he's he's right look at that friends now Reg you mentioned the itinerary today is uh, in order was um, Big Lonely Doug Big Lonely Doug if the road the road is a good chance has been deactivated because they 
knew we were coming, so they blocked it off. Yeah, but you've been here a, a, a few times with different... I've been here, um, so we're going to go there, and then we'll go to Avatar Grove, which is a grove of giant cedars, and I think there's some fur there as well. Wonderful. And then from thereafter, we'll go to uh, the Red Creek fur. Red Creek. So yeah. that's, that's the biggest fur in the world. Yes, the Red Creek, it's, I've heard this. Yeah, it's had a battering. The top is a bit smashed and... A battering? It's looking a bit like Bill and I, not so much like Hogan. <laughs> Hogan's pretty fresh. But um, it, it, everything that we're going to see is within probably 10k, a oh. bit 15k. Beautiful. And this is... <laughs> big incentive for showing you Port Renfrew. You should come and visit, it, seriously, man. It's, it's, it's a it's, wonderful place. It is, I, I've tried to say this, and now I've got Reg backing me up, friends. This is a, there's nothing like this in the world. Um, now, Reg, you mentioned about a deactivation here on the road now. Yeah. Now, do you think you could have something to do with that, bringing all these people here? Every chance. Yeah, you. Yeah. it's they your fault, in a sense. You could blame me, but it takes a lot more than that. It does, doesn't to it? stop this crew. Oh, oh, does it ever? We're, we're coming through. Yeah, we're coming through we're regardless. Coming, coming through. We saw a black bear right here yeah. coming no, he in. Didn't, really? Yes, we did. He jumped right in front of the car. I got really? it on the footage. Yeah. yeah. So that's yeah. a sign for the day, you see, it Reg. Is. When you see a black bear or any type of wildlife yeah. that not necessarily you see all the time, it means you're in for a hell of a day, friends. Right, Gadge? Right. I believe it. Yeah. So we got three believers in this little, what's it called? Celica. Del Delica. Delica, sorry. Mitsubishi. Mitsubishi. Yeah, Mitsubishi. Yeah. So friends, there's the breakdown. Um, our tour guide uh, from Victoria, kind of a, mm. a beautiful spot in its own right, but nothing like this. No. And that's why uh, Reg Coates, the famous Reg Coates, uh, once tree worker, now gone kind of... Geez, I'd have to say tour guide really is, is what comes to mind. He still cuts a little bit now and again, but no, no. he's breaking down. Mm. He's breaking down. <laughs> Far from it, friends. Okay, and get on his YouTube channel, Reg Coates, by the way, if you haven't already. Oh, she's a one-way street. We thought we might have took the wrong turn. Good afternoon, friends. We're... Uh, we're, 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 in the, we're in the mountains. We're right in the middle of the mountains. The logging road here. Uh, it, 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 it's just... You, you can't... Oh, dear Lord. That is outrageous. Like, I mean, it is just... What's, what's the word that, that comes to mind, Reg? I mean, wait... Spectacular. It is spectacular, it is, isn't it? It's, 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 it makes you stop and think. Look at that. Look at this, Reg. Yeah. This is, but look at the freaking about. water. It's so clear. Yeah, fantastic. You could see a fish in there from yeah. here, like nothing. That is just, I know the GoPro doesn't do this much justice, mm -hmm. friends, but this looks to me about a 200 foot drop. Mm, that was, yeah. That's a big drop, yeah. That's, yeah. That's Doesn't it, Reg? <laughs> That's yeah. Nice. Yeah. This is all. It's nice. It's nice to see the regen as well. Oh, it where is. They have replanted. It's lovely. They're getting up to the tops here now. Somewhere, yeah, somewhere but this, progress. this old growth here. Oh, look. There's somebody's shirt or something there. Look at that. Somebody <laughs> was camping out right there. See that? Yeah. Look at that. I'll bet you somebody was hovering in there. So here, here's a. There, there's a uh, an old growth fur there, friends. It, it just it's. It, it's just spectacular. It's got a top in it, relatively short, but it just, ah, oh, it's, it's hard to explain. The limbs are so short and stout, you know, and strong. It's just a different world when you get up high. It's so different. Gosh, this is beautiful up here. Little hemlocks growing out of the tops of those cedars, friends. Like, like literally, it's just, it's just amazing. Oh, it's beautiful here. This is nice, Reg. Yeah, it really is. I mean, this is the... I mean, it's free. It's free. That's what's fantastic. Yeah, it's free. You know, that's what's great about being on the logging roads. Nobody's bothering you. Look at down there. What an amazing little creek this is. And we're... What? How many K up are we, Reg, do you think, from Maine? Are we 6, 7, 8 K? Something yeah, like something like that. 
fir, alder, hemlock, everything here. Little hemlocks. It's beautiful. Things are things are very, very healthy up here. I'm not lacking. Wow, we're hi guys, back back again here. We're uh, we're on a quest here for the big lonely Doug. Okay, and uh, we're just making our way through this little bit of a regenerated forest here. Um, this is lovely to see these little cedars here. You see this, friends? Little firs. It's all being replanted. Oh dear, what's that down there? Oh, that looks like a big tree. A couple of characters here. You got you got Ganges leading the way. You got the English tree worker. You got ants. Look at this, look at this stump. That would have been fun to fall. Big Dutchman right there. That tree is ancient. Look at the grain in it. You wanna know something? I'll show you something right now. See this? There's a hundred years from here. You see you got 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. So you got a hundred years right there. Right there. That's a hundred years on that stump. Okay? These trees are ancient, ancient. So we're making our way. Oh, damn. Yeah. So. It's gotta be. Oh, this must have been a nice cut block, boy. Is that a 10 foot cedar? Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's 10 feet. So, could you imagine the lucky bugger that got to do this? Yeah. So, I'm not gonna take up a bunch of footage on this 4K, but look at this, friends. Oh, yeah. Yeah, see. This looks like. Look at the cedar. Look at how thin the bark is on the cedar. Look at it. This is a cedar tree, friends, okay? And that's how thin it is. If this was a fir, the bark would be out to here. Look at this freaking tree. Good looking stump on this one. This thing is massive. There's big Donnelly Doug right there. And she is a beauty. Just a beauty. We're in regen here. It's a beautiful forest. This is a this is a special special place friends I'm telling you this right now it is when you get to when you get to have access to a tree like this with regenerated forest around it it's a special place Rudge is already down there our tour guides took an off on us I'm gonna go catch him You got Ganges working his way down there. Oh yeah, it's a trail. People have been coming. Hi friends, back on. I just want to show you what we're into here. Like, you see this? It's all fresh growth, right? Like this is all, it, it's beautiful, beautiful fresh growth fur, okay? You look at it. Okay, is literally, see it cascading down there? It's so healthy and thick. All the wood in here, the regen I'm talking about, friends, okay, is, is beautiful. It, so what I'm saying is it's a healthy, look at how thick it is, okay? We're coming up on the big dug here now. And it is massive. There's no question about it. It is absolutely Massive. I see some root rod action there. You got some uh, conch going on about 30 feet up. You got a chunk of conch, but I, I'm actually interested in those grooves in the tree. That's kind of neat. Yeah. Look at that. Look at the regen, friends. Peekaboo. <laughs> the hemlocks. Hey, beautiful foliage. So this is your hemlock here. Okay. We're in a yeah, yeah, here it comes. Look at this. We got, oh, there's our guide. I'm glad he's here. Oh, and would you look at this? A beautiful little mountain balsam. Look at that. 
Oh, look at the beautiful foliage. Oh, that almost looks like a Mabilis fir. The needle configuration on that. Yeah, actually balsam's flat needled. Is that, that's, we call it balsam, but I think that might be a Mabilis. That's beautiful, isn't that, isn't that interesting? The only one around here besides this. This is all Douglas fir in here. Okay, so there, that explains it now that I'm at it. She's grown in a spiral a little bit. What a beast. Oh, it looks like a limb broke off there a little while ago. That's fat. Mm -hmm. Big in it, Mike. I mean, Sunny, look at how fat this is. Huge. Look at, look at this, friends. Son, you see the hardiness that when you get a sec boy, come and look at what's going on here with this foliage, man. This is gnarly, friends. This is, if I'm not mistaken, I'm thinking this is a Mabilis, unless that's, we call it balsam, is what we call it. Wow. <laughs> oh, jeez. You know, what did they say the height was of this, Reg? I think it was something of maybe 240. Yeah. Something like that. Yeah. It's lost its top a long time ago. It did, didn't it? So we, did, we don't know how big it was previously. But, right. Um, you don't get the feeling it's going to blow down anytime soon. No, you don't. You know I mean? when you no, it's like not. This. It's not going You've anywhere. have seen the many, many a storm. Probably was head and shoulders above everything that was cut here as well. Yes, it would have been. In the past and stood firm. So... Because it looks like all the other big stumps through here yeah. were cedar and they wouldn't have been nearly as tall. There's a different, they're a different animal. Uh, this almost looks like rigging. Yeah, somebody's had a steel choker there, haven't they? Yeah, there's been some rigging. Around. Now that could have been a tail hold. Right. Okay, from, from the logging. A long time. That's probably, what, that's probably what that was. That was a tail hold. They've never mentioned this in any of their videos. That goes in. You see, it's still healing it. It's still saying, no, not a chance. You're going to have to do a little more than that. See that, friends? Yeah. Hey, let me hold that and we can get you on for scale. Yeah. Let's I'll go that. stand up on that stump there. Yeah, no, no, it's, yeah, see, now it's starting to look more like fur bark on this side. This would be southern, I guess. Yeah, yeah. So look, look at this ridge. Come on over here and, and let's get the, the actual, I mean, it's big. Yeah. Yeah, it's massive. Isn't it? Yeah, it's almost, yeah, it's, doesn't look real, does it? No. That, it, that it, it grew alone, that it grew, that it's, it's a natural structure and not, you know, manufactured. It's amazing that this is what happens when you leave nature alone to do its thing. Yeah. Yeah, that and choker's it, gone all the way around. It, it was a tail hold. Yeah. Yeah, guaranteed it was. That This was a tail hold. Yeah. For logging logging practices. It's so old. Yeah. Because you know how thick this bark mm. is. Yeah. So so this was a big bad wound that it is actually yeah. compartmentalized. Yeah. You know, absolutely. I'd yeah. be interested to see. Isn't that huge? Mm, it's huge. Stand there and I'll I'll get a photograph from the Hogan. Good idea. Just so we, the, the, sometimes the cameras, the, the wide angle lens make them look small. It, it does, you're right. It doesn't do anything for it. Okay, I'm going to turn this off, friends. I don't want to lose. I want to save some for the Avatar Grove. Listen to me right now as I speak to you. This thing is special. If you're in the area, make the freaking trip to see this tree. It is a beast. It is not going anywhere. It's alive. It will be here for thousands of years. They don't even know the freaking lifespan of these trees. They don't know it. This is special. Hi friends. So here we are. This is cool. What did you think of these big trees, guys? Oh, uh, we found the best one, and basically, it's, a, it's at the very top. Okay, just before you start the story, I gotta let you know one thing. You're on the famous YouTube. What? We're right here, guys. You're on YouTube. What? What do you think about the world? Canada's gnarliest tree. Uh, it would basically be uh. 
a normal chainsaw, but ten times. <laughs> to cut it down? Yeah, ten times of a normal chainsaw. Ten times, okay. What do you think about that? Yeah, that's T totally. Totally it. What do you think, friends? What's your name? Eulen. Eulen. Ewan. Ewan. I like that. Otis. Otis. I'm digging that name, Otis. And who's dad? Garth. Garth. We need to say hi to these guys. Buck and Billy Ray's Tree Service is going to be your YouTube link that you're going to go to, and you're going to see yourself on YouTube, yes. if that's okay with dad. Yes. Sound good, guys? Yeah. Say hi to everybody. Hi. hi. Thanks, guys. Bye, guys. Buck and Billy bye. Ray's. Oh, look at these. So did you hear that? So they, they said, those kids said it would take a chainsaw, but 10 times, they said. <laughs> I think a 32 would do you all right. Oh, I'd be all right here with a 32 all day long. I don't pack nothing bigger than that. I think you'd be fine. Is, you know what? This is a nice grade too. You know what I mean? This this whole grade. Oh dear. Interesting, eh? They're, it's a shame they're so uh um what's the word? They're half and half, eh Reg? You know what I mean? Health wise? Well you don't get to be this old without a couple health issues, I don't think. They're quite old, aren't they? Big ones through there. Oh yeah. So here we are, friends. We're at the Avatar Grove, the famous Avatar Grove. And it is very, very cool here. Someone's taken the time to build some beautiful steps for us. Our tour guide, once again, Reg Coates, has been here several times. His excitement isn't quite as high as old Billy Ray and Hogan's and young Otis and Ewan and Garth. Look at that. Oh, look at this now. Isn't this neat? Yeah. Just big. Yeah, just, just clinging still. Cedar, cedar, friends, cedar alone for us here on, in where we live has been, it's, they've been clinging um, for a long time. So you can imagine how hard mother nature's striving to feed these things. They're ancient and they're just, uh, they're struggling and they're on a grade too, friends. So the water's running away really quickly here. Nothing sticks around the stumps. So they're searching, look at this. I mean, look at these roots, that's amazing. They're coming around back for the YouTube, the kids. Here comes the kids back for YouTube. I heard them, they're coming for us, friends. You watch, they're gonna be back here any minute. Hey, it's me again. Look at this. I think someone's living in Is somebody in there? Oh, it's him. It's him. There is somebody in there. Are you guys coming back again? I don't know if we're, you in, you in. Oh, so look at that. I wonder where that school marm ended up. Right there, right? If you'd like to go down again, you can go to See that, that part of the lower trail and come back up because there's another trail down there. Big school marm peeled off. Oh, you want to go on YouTube again? I just want to say something. Okay, listen, you got, we got very important news, friends. Very important news. I just want to, I just wanted to 
say that that was the gnarliest tree we were talking about. The gnarliest one. Yeah. And where's it at? Um, the top of the hill of, what is it called? Avatar Grove. Avatar Grove. Okay, you got that, friends? Okay, you got it? Good. Yeah. Over and out. Okay, thanks for that information, Otis. See a school marm friend peeled right off there. Neat grove, real neat grove. Oh, this is lovely in here. Very interesting. So, I guess this is actually kind of almost similar to what. See, there's hardly. See the underbrush, friends. It's just little bits of fern and, and shallow, but. Uh, where we just came from. Look at this hemlock clinging to the side of that cedar, friends. Look at it. Sucking the energy out of the cedar, to be quite honest. Big fur right there. Amazing. Oh, is there sunny? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's like a creek or a waterfall. Pretty neat. Did you catch them, kids? Just freaking their camera. Loving it. It's a good sign. This is neat, this. But see, that, that tree's getting to be, you know, pretty good size there now, that hemlock, a root's growing out of there. It's gotta be sucking, sucking some of the energy. That is a good size for Ganges. What are you up to over there? <laughs> okay. Isn't this neat, eh, friends? That's pretty cool. Old, old trees. Oh, look at this big daddy coming up. Here we are. We, we've reached the, uh, in someone's eyes, the Canada's gnarliest tree. Eh, I am, yeah, okay. It's a gnarly tree. Most, most out, it's a big cedar tree with an interesting uh, burl root system beautiful beautiful specimen but quite overripe she's got one you won't see it because of the lower canopy before but but it's got one stem in it friends that's relatively healthy right to the crown but it's got the main piece of it the the, the first uh, biggest piece it's just dead it's it's right dead there's a couple of school marms shooting off it you might see it up there but i think this is the attraction here Hey, Reg, the burl, yeah. the burl on this specimen, which is very neat looking. It's nice, and for a sense of scale, this is probably 12, 13 feet. All day long. Just from where the hemlock starts. Absolutely so, it so is. it is big, even if you can't see it on the camera. Yeah, it's very big. I actually think it's bigger than that, Reg, right. to be honest. But it's that all day. Yeah, yeah, it, you bet it is. But, yeah, probably a bit bigger. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't that neat, though, eh? Yeah, that's lovely. What, what a neat configuration that is. Lovely. Cool. <coughs> Reg? Yes, still. Um, where are we now? We are um, still in the Renfrew area. Um, nice one. Hogan. Oh. You can't walk by and make noises like what that. Are we 30 minutes drive from where we just, from Avatar Grove. 30 minutes from Avatar. I think it's taken about that long, slow going. That for sure. Yeah. yeah. And the Red Creek Fur is that way, up the trail. We've okay. We've got about five, ten minutes walk. Oh, to the tree. To the tree, we'll pass three massive cedars on the way, which are worth a look. I'm looking forward oh, to this. The three guards. The three guards, okay. Yeah. I think you might almost see them here. Yeah, it looks like fur up in there too. Yeah. This is neat. This is this is a neat, neat little journey so far. What's that racket, Sonny? Tree? Tree rubbing up a tree's creaking or something? There's no wind. It sounded like a little creaking sound. Did you hear it? See the effects of root rot. The Red Creek fir, friends, for those of you 
who don't know. We're, we're way, way the hell. I keep hearing it. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> it was loud. We heard it all the way up back. Right? Yeah. Like it, it was loud. Okay, we're going to the Red Creek fur. It is massive fur. It's the biggest fur in, uh, Canada. in Canada. Yeah. And that means probably anywhere else. Biggest, biggest in the world. Yeah, biggest fur in the world. In the world. Yeah. In the world. Yeah. In 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 volume. volume. Yeah, volume. Yeah. So we'll we'll take you up there. It's cool. We're in. Uh, just come out of that Avatar Grove, friends, and I just spotted off in the distance here. Some elk, quite a ways away, but there's a little herd here, maybe eight or ten animals. They're big animals, real big. Beautiful, beautiful field. You know, we've had just such a glorious day here today. There's been bear, elk. We've seen two bear, elk now, and we're going to the big Red Creek fur now. Just wonderful. No, I'd much rather be doing this than shopping in the mall. You know what I mean? Pretty cool.